Local coverage you can count on continues with Josh Ahan's Sports Report. Sports coverage you can count on. Yeah, I mean, it, it means so much. I've been playing since I was a freshman in high school. It's the first time I played in this tournament, I think. And I actually just got a memory. Seven years ago, I shot 110 here, and I was pretty excited about that. So I've come a long way, and I'm really excited. She won a city tournament title in her final year as a Mastodon. Now Emma Schrader has her sights set on winning back-to-back -back titles in the Summit City. Schrader is one of dozens competing in the 92nd Women's Golf Association City title. To repeat as a champion, Schrader would have to get past a crowded field on day one of match play. We take you to Chestnut Hills, the site of this year's Women's City Tournament. And we begin on hole number three where Amy Frazier the Fort Wayne native drills this punt for a birdie. She's grouped alongside former city champion Sarah Book, who also takes care of business on hole number three. That one is good for par. Meanwhile, back on hole number two, Casey Bunner, another former Mastodon and last year's runner up. She goes on to tap this one for a par. As far as last year's champion, Emma Schrader, she goes on to guide one in for par on hole number two. Now, after winning last year's city title, the former PFW golfer is soaking in the experience this time around. Well, there's always nerves with competition, but I haven't really been practicing or out golfing a lot, so I'm trying not to put pressure on myself and just have fun. Not doing it really super competitively just because I'm not really, that's not my mindset anymore. Oh, I mean, that would be awesome. Uh, not putting any pressure on myself to do that, but Back to back, there's not a lot of people who have done that. So, Day one results are still pending, but once those are available, you can find those on our website.